hello dear internet today i am going to make a video tutorial on contact form 7 you know contact form 7 is a contact form building plugin for wordpress websites there are many alternative options you have provided by wordpress repository but contact form 7 is the most used plugin ever you see it has 1 million plus active installs and this plugin has a very good documentation and supporting system. This plugin has some additional benefits like it has some other supporting plugins or extensions that can help you to extend the functionality of the plugin and there are more than 60 plus language translation service ready to use by plugin author so let's see how we can install this plugin into our wordpress website and configure it correctly to display a nice and robust contact form to install contact from cement plugin you need to log in first into your wordpress website then go to plugin add new menu it will give you a search option box here we can write the plugin name and press enter now you can see contact form 7 plugin is shown in very first place now press on install the plugin is installed and now press on activate plugin our contact form 7 plugin is activated now so we can go to settings of contact form by clicking here or we have another option to go to setting by clicking on this contact menu now we can see here is a built-in contact form we can edit it and we can see there are some field for that form is generated by default and we can use this form to see how it looks like in order to display this contact form we need to copy this short code and then we can go to page menu add new page and I am creating a page name contact us and pasting that shortcode into editor now click on publish and if I go to visit the page then we will be able to see a nice form ready to use now before creating our own contact form let's see how contact form 7 short course works and how mailing functionality works here in form tab we will be able to see four different fields and one submit button if we analyze on this block of code then we will see starting p tag and ending p tag here is the text with break tag making a new line this one and this short code is responsible to make output of this field this is the way and all other fields works exactly like this field this submit field is responsible to make this send button now let's see how mail functionality works if we go to this mail tab then we will see all the short codes are available here 
that are related to this field and there is a option to set a mail it is the admin email address where the form will be sent after submitting this form field is stated from where the mail will be sent to this mail this is the subject field it will contain the output of this field and there are another option named additional headers if you want to make a reply to link to submitted email then you can set it here and here is the message body section here just used a from and your name shortcode here your email shortcode here a subject static text and then your subject and then a message body normal text and below that this message field output will be here these are the basic functionality settings of contact form 7 now if we go to send a form creating test subject and test message and if I now press on send button then we can see it is saying your message was sent successfully thanks if I go to visit my email address then I will be able to see one message is received in my inbox this message contains from my name test subject and message body that is how we can configure and add a basic contact form with our site using contact form 7.